that talk about me brown judge and do say me black me slim me tell them borrow bant and no fat me dj fi ball head and jet lock what the deal what the deal what the deal dancehall artist pompete says she has no regrets after recently giving birth to a healthy baby boy who is fathered by a married man according to pompete she is not bothered by the situation because complicated relationships are relatively normal the outspoken dj also released a song called husband lock in which she brags about the situation the goody good singer also give details about the relationship stating the woman's husband constantly like her instagram photos and treats her very well yes it's something that i'm experiencing everybody do for people life you always have the side girl till them become wife so basically and that's sort of thing they a real thing man nobody don't perfect well pompey is in that situation and i'm dealing with it i'm have it locked that's why i'm talk about it yeah everybody do go in people life until they become the one so nobody don't perfect i always them to judge me <laughs> What the deal? A video of Vegas challenging the warlord has been making rounds on the internet. However, Vegas tells music news that the boxing challenge is nothing serious as it was just a hypothetical question asked by an interviewer. It's on the table. I'm giving up the purse money. 50k. US. Monte Killer and Mr. Vegas in the arena boxing. Yeah. 50k Monte Killer. Monte Killer people, get at me. You know, so I had an interview and the person who did the interview asked me if I was going to the boxing ring with any artist, which artist would it be? And I say, the general, see him? And I say, me put up all the purse money. So, and it's a question the mark, so I mean, just answer. <laughs> I don't know nothing serious, it's just real for everybody at talk about this thing, but I don't know the man, the general put up snow, say, ask the mark, me a question, and because me know, say, if you're going to a boxing ring, me not going to a boxing ring like matter, and because I come back me to fight one girl. So, me just say, the general, because me know, say, general, big and bad. So, I don't know nothing, general, no worry yourself, man, me a good man, you don't know. I'm used what the deal? Tamale travel restrictions have been eased until September 1st, allowing the DJ to perform at shows overseas. Tamale and his co accuses to return to court on May 6th. In more court related news, entertainer Tamale, a prodigy of cartel, appeared before the corporate air criminal court today for breaches of the Lottery Scam Act. Four other persons accused in the case also appeared in court. During this morning's proceedings, the court relaxed travel restrictions which were imposed on the entertainer. The court ordered that his travel documents be returned to allow for uh, him to perform overseas until September 1. Tommy Lee, whose given name is Leroy Russell, and the other accused are to return to court on May 6. The five were charged in February with breaches of the Lottery Scam Act after police raided a house occupied by the entertainer in St. Andrew and reported finding items used in the scam. What the deal? According to sources, Director of Public Prosecutions Paula Llewellyn has confirmed that she and members of her prosecution team have received death threats after the guilty verdict of Vibes Cartel and his three co-accused for the murder of former associate shit Clive Lizard Williams. Paula had been threatened on the weekend and security around her had been beefed up. What the deal? Vibes Cartel will be doing a lot of plowing, bushing, and sanitation work in prison to fulfill the hard labor of his sentence. In recent history, hard labor has changed in Jamaica. In the past, we used to do a lot of quarry mining when inmates were given hard labor. Now, an inmate who has been given hard labor would do more plowing and bushing of the land. And because there are no ancillary staff in the adult correctional centers, inmates serving hard labor would do all the sanitation work. What the deal? 
Sean Storm reportedly refused an offer from the prosecution to plead guilty to accessory before or after the fact of murder. This was confirmed by his attorney, Miguel Lorne, and Director of Public Prosecution, Paula Llewellyn. Lorne said his client, known by the stage name Sean Storm, was not asked to give any evidence against his co-accused, but refused the deal because he was not a part of any common design to kill Clive Lizard Williams. If he had accepted the offer, Sean Storm would have served a three-year sentence. <laughs> Them say me mash up on me day a same way A Gaza me say me say a fire same way Still a represent empire same way Fuck your bill every still a get a ya same way True. Me no Judas so me na go betray no. Me no Peter where deny the DJ no. Them one crucify me like Jesus Christ But I give a dad the devil so me na play <laughs> What the deal? According to sources, Vibes Cartel may be allowed to record from behind bars closer to the time when he will be eligible for parole, which is around 70 years old. An inmate that enters the Department of Correctional Services is thoroughly assessed as it relates to risk, risk of harm, risk of reoffending. That person has to be put through a period of rehabilitation. His prospect for recording is more likely towards the end of the sentence. That's any in me. What the deal? People, make sure you check out alanvice.com for the latest music, news, and mixtape. It is very easy to sign up, so come and join the community. What the deal? What the deal? What the deal? Ain't nothing new. Fassi been around, that's the truth. Long time them they are in a route to take boot. Me you say me sabi, I one of them new recruits. Get up every day and a pressure they get to do. And up for them a wolf and a wear rasta suit. Work with it, father. No try stop the loot. The girl them out a road and said that DJ are cute. Alias no mix with fruit. 